hi, I'm Andre, and I took Mr. Wax's class in grade 10, 11, and 12, including IB Computer Science. Um, I am now in the second year of my computer science degree at U of M. I am not employed in computer science and yet um, co-op is next year. I work at Unicity at, in, in the winters. Um, come say hi. Um, transition. Um, I want to talk about Mr. Wags and how he handles his class. Um, Mr. Wags is a very rare kind of teacher who cares about the subject he teaches. He puts his heart and soul into the material. He prepares it and he uh, teaches it with the amount of effort that you rarely see um, ever. And as I go into uni, I continue to see that it, his um, his level of um, effort is continuously rare, rarer. Um, yeah. Computer science is, um, a very, um, uh, very, very popular at U of M. So much so that you can't enter your two courses until you've declared your major in computer science because there's so much demand that you have to, um, limit the amount of people joining and the comps is the only uh, major that has this happen because it's a uniquely popular course for good reason. Lots of jobs, lots of good pay. I'm sure Mr. Walks will or had or already has mentioned just how um, enticing computer science is. Um, there's not really a good reason not to be a computer scientist. And if you're successful in this field, it's a very um, good job. Transition. Um, my setup for school consists of a laptop and a monitor at home. It's just to prevent uh, screen burnout and to have it be portable. <laughs> Can't take a PC tower on your on the bus to uni especially how long it can be but that's besides the point this is how it all looks it's just it's a lot of rgb i couldn't resist um <laughs> you don't need rgb you don't need a keyboard you don't need a monitor all you need is a laptop I started off computer science in high school with um, a word processing laptop that had two cores, one of which was burned out and could barely run Minecraft. But it was all I needed to get started in Mr. Wax's class and uh, to continue learning at home. Um, yeah. It's a, a very accessible field, especially with how prevalent technology is. I'm sure that most people have access to laptops or computers. And if not, then it is a re it's a problem that can be remedied with a summer job relatively easily. Um, at least I hope. Transition. Um, in terms of advice and transitioning from high school to real life i definitely think that it's too early to make that call right now um you do not have the um perspective necessary to make life altering decisions take a gap year please take a gap year it does wonders to calm your nerves after high school Especially if you take IB. Oh. Um, um, yeah. And 
specifically for choosing if you want to go into a specific field like computer science. Um, I found that when I took it, I found that a lot of small victories like, um, I don't know, writing a line of code before the IDE could underline it as red, or f writing a function and having it run first try perfectly. And having those small victories made me really, um, it made computer science feel like it was a, a sort of game that you were um, leveling up through. And so far, it's continued to stay that kind of experience. And even as I spend an entire evening, hours and hours debugging C code, I find that it's still fun to to do it because I, I'm pretty interested in the concepts that we're learning. Um, from what I hear, it stays interesting. And depending on which way you take your degree, um, it can be modified to suit your unique experience. Um, and it's, um, it's definitely a degree that you can dual wield with other stuff because over half of the credits for our degree are actually in Yuva are actually electives. So you can fit in an entire other degree just with computer science. You could have a minor with way more credits than necessary. I was, I, I'm particularly partial to history, but that's um, just me. It's a degree that allows for great freedom and for flexibility inter inside of the degree and outside of the degree. Um, yeah. I hope high school works out. I, yeah, good luck. And please take a gap year. Please take a gap year. Okay, bye.